this morning, there's so much to do. Thursday, April 22nd, 2010. Well, it's about 12.20. I was trying to do some editing, but apparently, rather than editing, I'm just sitting here listening to myself babble on and on, <laughs> trying to get a point across that either in one hand I got across a long time ago or a point that I don't know how to express. It's about 12.50, I'll want to be walking to work at about 1. I don't know how much more I can sit there and listen to myself say, observation, observation this, observation that, blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. About 1.05, just came across some empty box that must have fallen off of some truck or something or another. Essentially, it's litter on the side of the road. If you were just to think, you know, a bunch of litter and garbage on the side of the road with a caption of classic. Cisco. It just cracked me up. I had to snap a photo of it. 3.40 here. Fun break at work. It's raining and I'm out walking around because, you know, I don't have any cigarettes and I still have sense not to spend the money because I'm out of the budget. Eh. So I'm walking around. It's about 6.54. I actually kind of like walking in the rain here. You know, it'd be nice if I had a little bit larger of an umbrella, but this works out all right. I could do with a little bit more than just residential area around here. Hadn't to tread my own path through here because they won't build sidewalks in this part of the town. They also won't build, uh, won't build drainage systems over there on the road. Feels nice out, you know? If you ignore all the cars, gosh, maybe it kind of sucks to walk. But that's just all because of aesthetic things, though. Just that I'd like it to not be so noisy. I'd like there to be a actual path and all. 6.59 p.m. I stopped by and had a look at the cameras that they have for sale at Walmart. Selection is pretty limited, but there was one of them that I was looking up on the internet. One of the Sony Handycams. I mean, I know they call pretty much all of their little camcorders Handycams. This one caught my eye because it was, it looked like it was pretty small, you know. It might kind of split the difference between the sort of camera that I want for all the bells and whistles and the sort of camera that I want for it just being compact and, you know, kind of point and shoot, let's go sort of thing. It does have that form factor where it's nice and small, fit in my hand real easy, you know. It's not too terribly expensive. You know, I just wish I could have had a closer look at like the specs on it because I remember a lot of the cameras I was looking at on the internet, they didn't have very fleshed out specifications. In other news, I am, uh, I am keeping relatively successful at switching into my house slippers whenever I come in the house. 7.22. I just finished off that leftover pizza. Didn't even need to warm it up. It had been sitting out the whole time. It was room temperature. Good enough. Now I've got myself a little bowl full of blackberries and I'm gonna try to finish up that editing of the 17th. Oh yes, and coffee. 8.30 right now. The April 17th video is uploading. Drink some coffee, I guess. It's 8.47. That is a friggin' tree that has sprouted up in the middle of a rose bush. 9.22 p.m. 9.32 p.m. I got my scooter engine apart to the point where I can see the piston. And I was really excited to take the piston out so that I can clean it because there's a bunch of gunk all over the piston and the valves and all that where the combustion goes on but guess what in the innards of this thing there's a freaking nut that is stripped freaking pisses me off Meow. <laughs> it's Thursday April 22nd at 10:24 p.m. out of context it might seem rather odd Thursday, April 22nd at 10.33 p.m. It's uh, Thursday. Did I say that already? Kim, I love you. Everyone else, thanks for watching.
walking during my work breaks is becoming a nice habit of mine. I didn't mention that I drank way too much coffee that day and actually gave myself an upset stomach. And that was really disappointing about the scooter. I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to easily take the rest of the engine apart. I might very well just put it all back together from here, not having taken the thing entirely apart, which I wanted to do. Mm -hmm.